In July 2016, an international tribunal at The Hague categorically rejected China's claims to the South China Sea, ending a three-year legal battle with the Philippines. This case also affected Taiwan, which has its own claims to the highly disputed waters. In a bold effort to reinforce its position, Taiwan sent a warship to the region. And according to the Taiwanese government, this is just the beginning of its military advances in the area. So just how powerful is Taiwan? Well, in terms of its size and population, Taiwan is relatively small. The country is home to roughly 23 million people, considerably less than its populous neighbors, China, Japan, and the Philippines. Taiwan is also just under 14,000 square miles, or slightly larger than the U.S. state of Maryland. But despite its modest size, Taiwan has a considerable impact on the global economy. With a GDP of more than $520 billion, the country's economy is the largest outside the United Nations. Traditionally, Taiwan is heavily reliant on farming. However, after rapid industrialization during the second half of the 20th century, the country shifted its focus to manufactured exports like electronics and machinery. Today, Taiwan's economy is industrial, capitalist, and extremely export-driven. In fact, the country, alongside the high-income economies of Hong Kong, South Korea, and Singapore, are known as the Four Asian Tigers. Taiwan also benefits from its unique economic partnership with China. In 2014, bilateral trade amounted to nearly $200 billion, making China Taiwan's largest trade partner, as well as their primary destination for direct foreign investment. However, many have argued that Taiwan is too dependent on China. And in fact, China's slowing economic growth has already affected the island's somewhat fragile economy. Further complicating the matter, China and Taiwan have been in conflict since the island formed its own government in 1949. China claims that Taiwan is a part of their country and has blocked the island's attempts at independence. Taiwan, on the other hand, prohibits reunification with China without a public referendum and legislative support. What's more, Taiwan lost its seat in the United Nations in 1971 when the UN chose to recognize China instead. Many have argued that looming tensions with China have led Taiwan to build up a robust military. The country boasts nearly 2 million defense personnel and a defense budget of more than $10 billion. Proportionally, that's about the same as the U.S., which is famous for prioritizing defense. But despite its standing conflicts and precarious political situation, Taiwan is, by most accounts, thriving. Despite a global economic slowdown, the island's economy continues to diversify, and its poverty rate remains one of the lowest in the world. Taiwan also ranks exceptionally high in terms of press freedom, health care, and quality of life. So although the country is often overshadowed by its large, populous neighbors, there's no question that Taiwan is incredibly powerful on its own. To learn more about Taiwan's complicated relationship with China, check out this video. But by 1987, Taiwan began allowing residents to visit mainland China, and both countries established institutions to deal with governmental relations. Thanks for watching Secret Daily. Please don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see new videos every day.